guys, welcome back to another episode of The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Let's get right into it. We have to find Feller's Goat using the bell in your Witcher's senses. Oh yeah, right, the bell should be somewhere around here. Palace Bell. How do I do it? R1? Yeah. Come here, goat. Oh. Wait. Do I hear a dog? Like a this wild way, dog? I think. I think. You're not sure? Yeah, there they are. But why are there tricks there and there? Yeah, that goat is not gonna be alive. Oh, I hear the goat. Come here, goat. Did you hear it? Oh, that's a fool. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Roll, Geralt. Oh. Sure, let's suit their bodies. Dog, hello. Wolf sliver. Raw meat. And more dog tello. Now where are you at, little goat? Oh, there it is. Wait. Oh, it's way further. Come here. Come here, you little There goat. you are. Princess. Wait, why does she have a health here, bar? Here, goat. Here, princess. Do we Looking have to horned. protect a goat? Should have known it would be stubborn. Come on. Alright, time to try the bell. Should Come on, guessed as much. What's a witcher compared to a patch of wild strawberries? Yeah, what was that about strawberries and raspberries? Where the hell did you go? Come here, goat. No, 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 no. I lost the goat. I lost the goat. Come here, goat. Come here. Princess. Why did you put it away? Can I just pick him up? Bear! Run, you stupid piece of shit! Bear? 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 It's a bear! Oh no. Oh, he got me. Oh yeah, he missed that. Okay. But I've got an insanely good sword here. Look at how much damage it does. Also, I really love this battle. Nope. There you go. Let's take that. Come on up, princess. Do I really have to keep ringing this bell for you to follow? Yeah, I guess so. We're gonna keep doing it. <laughs> this is probably the most silly quest I've ever had to do in any game. You're no roach. I bet we could be friends in time. You've got that all-important quality every roach has to have. You don't talk much. What? See, I love Geralt. I've told you before. His humor is on point. Flee not from the pillar, for there are wolves about. Goat of mine, dearest, sweetest goat.
Happy for you, but I'm kinda in a hurry. Anna and Tamara, they might be in danger. The White Wolf helped the Pella, and so the Pella shall help him. Blood. We need blood. A living being. Fine. Be right back. do It's over? Is that it? That is it. Spirits had nothing more to say? Like where they went or where they are now? You came for an augury, an augur I did. They're gone, the child remains. Mentioned a child. Whose? Why, Anna's. Anna was pregnant? She was. And she miscarried. Hmm. Baron didn't mention it. Afraid, perhaps. Or ashamed, or forgetful. Or perhaps he had no wish to remember. Anna tell you all this? Did she come here after it happened? Nay, not Anna. Twas the omens told me. Great, so I can be sure it's true. The omens need not your faith to be true. It is you who needs the omens to lead you to truth. The Baron have anything to do with his wife's miscarriage? Foul-tempered he is, and he's a fondness for Hooch. No doubt makes his temper even fouler. Did he abuse his family? Anna came to you, you must have noticed something. The Pella's old, near blind. But Princess came and licked her hand. So what? She's a wise beast. Only comes to those who suffer. What happened to the child? In a grave throne, without rite or ceremony, it awoke. Now it wanders, it seeks vengeance. A botchling. White wolf, wise wolf, catch the botchling. The botchling will help, lead the wolf to the loved ones. Botchlings suck the blood of pregnant women and eat their fetuses. They don't help. Tis a being cursed, and witches lift curses. If the white wolf can't lift it, he should bring me its blood. Blood will always find kindred blood. Whatever I do, I gotta find the botchling first. Seek it at midnight, near the grave that lies empty. If what you say is true, the Baron ought to know where that grave is. Read the bestiary to learn more about botchlings. That's the first thing we're gonna do. Um, cursed ones, vulnerable against cursed oil, and the Axi sign. Wow, that's a long text. I'm not gonna read all of that. Saying a botchling's ugly is like saying shit's not particularly tasty. Can't say it's a lie, but it doesn't exactly convey the whole truth either. Hmm. A botchling's curse can be lifted by transforming it into a lubricant. 
the guardian spirit of the heart that watches over the family it never knew in the house. What? A guardian spirit of the heart that watches over the family it never knew in the house it never could call home. Wow. Okay. So let's go talk to the Baron. Come on, Roach. Wow. I got 100 experience points for finding a goat. Whoop, I should go looking for goats more often. PayPal! PayPal! What is he yelling? PayPal? Do they have PayPal in the world of the Witcher? Seems quite odd to me. Ah, uh, there is one of those priests. I'm assuming they'll be. Lightning strike. Oh no. What happened there? He said lightning strike? There's no bad weather, Geralt. Weather is good. So it means that. Someone started a fire? Oh boy. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Come on, go, 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 go. Get that door open. Go. Yes, fire. Do something about it. Oh, but it's all wood. Oh no. That's bad. Oswin? Where's Oswin? Anyone seen him? I believe I saw him heading to the stable. What? Fire. You blind? Nobody willing to put it out? Ain't that simple. Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable. We've got to save him. He'll burn alive. Him and the horses. See what I can do. Hurry now, quick! Come on, let's get him out. So there's... <laughs> there's a bear. Seems... Let's get him out here. Lots of smoke. Gotta hurry. Yeah, gotta hurry. Come on. Come on, run. Where is he? Well, oh, but he's stuck inside a wall. I do it? Okay, there's a horse. Ha 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 ha! We've a hero in our midst! The horses! Why, I'm prepared to forgive you the drubbing you gave those pricks at the crossroads! I know your wife miscarried. Was that before or after you beat her to a pulp? What the fuck are you suggesting? Don't play me for a fool. You'd been beating them for years. Finally, they'd had enough and fled. Sound about right? Ah! Oh, we're going in a fist fight with the Baron now? They ran from you, didn't they? Lying prick! Well, I've been practicing my fist fights, so it should be good. Just need to wait until they attack. Dodge. Ooh. He's quicker than I expected. Usually you can dodge and go boom boom. 
And dodge again. That's it. You just dodge. Light attack, heavy attack. Oh, dodge again. Light attack, heavy attack. Fist fighting is actually quite easy. There you go. Wow. Okay, girls. We need to talk. Sit down. You beat them. I never laid a finger on Tamara. Not once. And on Anna. That's another story. She always knew how to spark my ire. Your wife. How'd she make you angry? Too much salt in the soup? Socks never darned? Twenty years we've known each other. She seen me drunk and sober. She was there to greet me when I returned the victor. She was there to patch me up in defeat. Like no other, she knew where to press, where to pinch, so it would hurt. You beat her? For that? For criticizing you? Oh, Witcher, you haven't a clue, have you? Well, perhaps I shall tell you about it one day. One day, but not today. You knew they had run away from the start. Yes, I knew. Why didn't you tell me? Wasted my time. Say I had. Say I'd said I had troubles. Couldn't control my wife, my daughter. What kind of flaccid prick would you take me for? Tell me everything you remember about the day they fled. The truth this time. I'd been soaking myself three days straight. Anna came to me, said they were leaving. I begged them to stay. She refused to hear it. I tried to stop her. She wriggled like an eel. We struggled. She fell. Last Blasted thing I remember. Woke up in the morn, breeches heavy with my own piss. A large bump on my head. Sadly, they were gone. Know what that's like, Witcher? No. How the fuck could you? I was left with nothing. Nothing! Only the bottle. What happened next? Next? It only got worse. I awoke at sunset, not knowing how many days had passed. Thought it was all a plowing, drunken nightmare. And then I went to the bedchamber, and Anna was not there. Instead, there was blood everywhere. I knew. She'd miscarried. My breath short, my throat locked. I neared the bed and saw it. It lay there, a tiny thing, defenseless, on bloodied sheets, dead. And it was my doing. Maybe you're doing, maybe not, but that amulet she wore could be important, or maybe the fact that she lost it. What did you do with the child? What was I to do? Took it out and buried it. Just like that? Damn you! I gave no thought to a funeral. It was a horror. I wanted it to end. That child had been my dream. I told Anna 
the little one, our little one, to make things right. Yet she died before she could be born. Understand, Witcher. My child was dead. I sympathize. I do. Thank you. And know that I hope you find your Siri. Deal we made means I need to find Tamara and Anna first. Just so happens your unborn daughter might help us do that. What? How? Sometimes miscarried fetuses, if they don't get a proper burial, turn into botchlings. Into... fucking what? Details you don't need to know. There's a bond of blood between this creature and your wife and daughter. I can use that bond to find them. How? One of two ways. Legends claim you can bury a botchling under the family's threshold, perform a ritual and turn it into a lubberkin. That's a sort of, uh, hob. A guardian spirit that could lead me to your family. And the other way? We kill it and draw some blood. Take that to the Peller and he does the rest. Do not kill my child. It's suffered enough already. Lift the curse that it may finally rest in peace. Whatever we do, we gotta find the botchling first. I'll show you where I buried her, and I'll dig the grave at my threshold. If it turns out we can't transform the botchling into a lubberkin, they can bury us in it. Handy either way. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight, at midnight. Then wait here with me. Near midnight, I'll take you to where I buried her. Get word to the common folk. Ought to stay in their homes tonight and draw a line of salt outside their doors. And try to sober up. Do I take a shovel? To dig up the grave? Take it. You'll need it, but not for that. A bit further. Follow me. Okay, I'm gonna pause it here and continue this in the next episode. It's been a good one today. And then, yeah, next episode we're gonna try to turn the botchling into a lubricant. What the hell that even is, I don't know. But I'd like to thank you for watching and hope to see you in the next episode.